become a cliche. It's a shame either team had to lose, but that's the way it felt on Saturday. An amazing state championship game between Peoria High and Nazareth. The Peoria High Lions got off to a slow start in Saturday's state title game. But after falling behind 22-8, the Lions roared. Peoria High made big plays in the passing game. They got 287 yards rushing from their all-state back, Malachi Washington. Peoria High made play after play, but so did Nazareth Academy. Nazareth Academy winning a classic state title game 45-44. They played their tails off uh, consistently, and uh, we just came up, obviously, one short. Um, extremely proud of them. Love this group. Uh, you know, they'll be Lions forever. Nazareth Academy is led by big-time Big Ten recruits, but the best player on the field, again, was Peoria High running back Malachi Washington. Some college is going to get a heck of a back in Malachi. Oh, I think he's made a case as a college football player since, uh, you know, that first week against Metamora. Uh, he uh, punishes defensive backs. Uh, it's really, really hard to tackle at the end, and he accelerates as the game goes on. So uh, I think there's no doubt he plays in college, and uh, I really think he should play at a high level. Lots of Lions tears at the end of the game, but moments later after getting their second place trophy, Peoria High mighty proud of the season and their accomplishments getting to Champaign. We wanted to come out in first, but we got second. Um, I'm still grateful for the result because, you know, we put in a lot of work to be here. It still hurt pretty bad, I ain't gonna lie to y'all, but I know all my brothers, man, they gave me they all, I gave my all, so man, it, we just came up one point short. A season full of victories, pride, and a state runner-up trophy. Congratulations to the Peoria High Lions. On to basketball now, and the Kevin Brown Memorial Tournament of Champions again attracted the best teams and players from across the country. But it was a local team that maybe impressed as much as any team. Metamora went 2-2 two and two on the weekend, including a huge double-digit rally to beat a top team from Texas on Saturday night. Playing for the first time ever in the National Classic, the Redbirds say they improved as a team, especially in their two losses. Well, you, you always learn what's going to happen when you get pressured. You know, pressure makes the pipe break. We broke a couple times. Uh, we didn't have the leadership we needed. Just little things that if you don't really play the best in the country, you won't find out. So we're very pleased to come over here and, and get our tail whipped, I guess. Now, I doubt the Redbirds get their tail whipped too many more times this season. Hey, tonight's a big night of high school basketball championship night at the Inner City Tournament. All the highlights for you tonight at 10. Jim Dandy time, right back to that Kevin Brown Memorial Tournament because it is a tournament for charity honoring KB Strong, raising money in the battle against glioblastoma. Many huge check presentations all week. Great basketball, great charity, great Jim Dandy.